Got him? Yeah. Fish on. Oh, big one. Big one. That's a big one. You, you got this. You got this. <laughs> yeah. oh, <laughs> That's giant. Oh, my God. That's giant. Un, un, dos, y un, Take the elevator for what we We're in Mexico, boys. See? What's up, Mexico? We made it. Guys, welcome. We're on a new adventure. Doing new things. Uh, this is part, if you guys followed along on the previous series, you saw Eric was hunting coos deer in Old Mexico. This is part two. We are here to chase, hunt, fish for some trophy class bass. Uh, welcome to Lake Bacarac Lodge. We got a whole host of guys with us. Look at this crew we just rolled in with. You're probably gonna know some of them, familiar faces. Trent Trevor from Born and Raised Outdoors. Uh, Justin Rackley from Lake Fork Guy, one of the Guggen Squad dudes. And a new friend we just met, Juan Senor Bass. He's got a pretty big Spanish, uh, Mexican YouTube, bass fishing, and hunting channels. And then a few other buddies. So we're gonna be uh, targeting trophy class bass in Mexico. And uh, can't wait, new stuff. I'm not much of a bass fisherman. Casey's got a little bit of experience. Logan has a little bit of experience. I would say Justin is highly accomplished. Juan is highly accomplished. Uh, a few of the other guests have some pretty good accolades. And even the Born and Raised boys do a little bass fishing. So come with us, guys. Let's go take a tour. Let's get the first glimpse of this awesome lodge. All right, let's 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 show you what the best part of this whole lodge is. It's obviously the view and the little gazebo where we have lunch, hang out, have some refreshments after a long day of fishing. <laughs> so, when you first get here, this is probably everybody's first stop. This is the bait and tackle shop. Check out some of the ginormous bass on the wall and the array of goodies they offer. A lot of money has been spent here. So far, we haven't caught anything quite this size, but we're working towards it. All right, so this is the dining hall. They serve us breakfast and dinner in here. Got the cooler full of refreshments, some tables, and uh, the kitchen back there. So far, I would say the food is muy bueno. The accommodations, I would say, are good. Nothing crazy. It's not like your normal Mexico trip where you're gonna have like a pool, a spa, a hot tub. This is just more like a fishing lodge, right? So let's go show you what one of the rooms looks like. Welcome to Room Cinco. Dang, your room is so much cleaner than ours. <laughs> That's why I picked ours. That's a great idea. All right, guys, here's what the rooms look like. A couple beds, a bathroom, a little changing area, some station. Here. Whoa, there's somebody in there. <laughs> I'm gonna heads up. Well, you're, Anyways. <laughs> you're a part of the tour, Chell. That's gonna make a great video. <laughs> this is what it's all about, guys. Lake Bacarac Lodge. But the best part about it is this lake right here. Full of big bass. Highly recommended. Double digit, call it what you want. It can be 12. Whoa, coming in hot. Guys, welcome. We are in Mexico. Um, <laughs> that's happening. I couldn't decide how, gotta lower my shirt already. Couldn't decide how I was gonna haul all my gear down there. I'm 
taking the whole suitcase. <laughs> Roll it right onto the boat and be like, Juan, what do we want? Uh, first morning down here in uh, Lake Baccarat. So here's the program. We're gonna go crush faces. Uh, the fishing's been a little slow, we've heard from the other guests, which is all right with me. We'll uh, change that. I've heard of a phrase called match the hatch. We're, it sounds like we might have to create the hatch. So we're gonna go eat some breakfast. I've got stuff everywhere. So you just work on this for a minute. Okay. That's my plan right now. <laughs> morning, guys. How's it going, love? Pretty swell. Did you get a coffee morning? Morning coffee? Tell you what, that was, that was enjoyable. Can't beat that, huh? Just a nice rise and shine. Coffee's ready, sir. You boys ready? We're just getting stuff organized. I feel pretty good. Got a lot of stuff done last night. Yeah. Go have some breakfast and see what this lake offers. Um, I, think, I think this is the Sounds noob nice. room. <laughs> Jail and I are probably the most Good. unexperienced Good. bass anglers at this entire lodge. Oh yeah. But I'm going out with uh, Juan, We're our out. new friend Juan, who is a very seasoned bass angler. So I feel good about that. I'm gonna learn some things today. Logie's gonna go out with uh, Mr. Rackley. Just two anglers, dude, just angling their way into the best. Second best boat. He, he Chell, Chell got the best partner, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> you guys got second best. So good luck. coming in hot this morning. So good luck. <laughs> Somebody's coming in hot. But uh, yeah, I don't know what to expect so far. Uh, we really haven't been here during the daylight hours. We like just got here at sunset, so we'll see what see what the day brings. Day one. Let's go. Guys, we've been here 12 minutes this morning. We're already getting made fun of because Casey literally packed a suitcase full of gear. Um, the guides are just like laughing, <laughs> which I don't blame them. I mean, kind of overkill. Even the pros, like you know, Rackley, Juan, their tackle box doesn't look anything like a full suitcase. <laughs> Looks just right. Do you have any words of wisdom for today? Do I need to say anything else? <laughs> Look at this. What gardening tools did you bring from Home Depot? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like he's gonna plant plant some agriculture. Okay. Right. When I'm absolutely just throttling giants today, and you're over there going, "What is his secret?" Hey, hey, it's okay, dude. My mom loves that hat too. My mom. Loves B -Mac, that hat too. B Mac, make sure they don't leave without Ben. He's he was in his room taking a potty. Let's go. B-Mac, do you have any marigolds or anything? Right and white marigolds. Marigolds. <laughs> what's this what's the perennial here, Trent? <laughs> you wanna be on the news? We're here. Look at the guides, they're just like waiting. They're like, I don't want that guy. <laughs> so, lots so of judging going judging. on right now. Just like, I don't want that guy. <laughs> they, they the fake pointed, camo guy. They painted a <laughs> big fake camo right guy. at Casey with his gloves on already. <laughs> they said bath towel, check. Nippers, check. Bass jersey, take him. <laughs> That's the guy I want on my Sorry, boat. Check. I'll just give you that. Guys, good morning. Uh, we were just pulling into our spot. So let me introduce you to our good buddy Juan, right, right here. Juan, otherwise known as Senior Bass Fishing, has what is it? Is the biggest, biggest bass fishing channel in Spanish? In Spanish, hundred percent Spanish. That so is. if you guys want to learn some Spanish, you're the guy. I'm the guy. So, Spanish and fishing at the same time. I like so. I'm a new, I'm a newbie to this bass game. Juan is very seasoned, and I was lucky enough to get paired up with Juan. So uh, I, I know for a fact I'm gonna learn a lot today. Probably gonna do a lot of observing, and uh, just he's gonna tell me what I should and should not do. So we're about ready to kick off this amazing trip. Uh, stick with us. We're gonna be rocking the GoPros on the chesties. Hopefully we'll get a lot of hook set action, and uh, maybe just if we're lucky tie into. A big fish. There are 10 plus pound bass out here, so uh, all over. The the opportunities are are endless, from what we're told. Here we go. Got one. Nice. Tengo una. Oh. Y viene con la lagartija. Prototipo. There you go. Hey, first one on the the lizard. Yeah. Prototype. That's right. <laughs> Good work, Juan. Thank you. It's working our way up this little channel. It's gonna happen. I've noticed you're real deliberate on your hook sets. Like, you're like, oh, there's a fish. 1001, 1002, 1000. Yeah. Wow. You know what I mean? They will, they will give you time. 
They will. It's, oh, yeah. it's like, just kind of like you can feel them. You right? feel it. Yeah. And yeah. then you like check again and, and you're like, okay, look, right, like right now. You got it. <laughs> Called it, dude. Yeah, Juan. They're getting a little bit bigger. Yeah, dude. We were just talking through hook set technique. Yeah. And uh, Juan basically just gave me a live demonstration. <laughs> nice. Good work. There you go. Good work. Another well, one pounder. Yeah. Just working through the little guys. And they're gonna, they're gonna get bigger for sure. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Here we go. That fish is half mine, okay? <laughs> I made that count. But he did. I'll give you credit. Blue. You got a blue? Yeah, yeah it's blue. Good. A little blue or the big one? That one. On him? First one. On. There we go, baby. Is that a baby? Look at that, three nice. casts. Nice. Great first fish. Yeah, first cast. Dude. Hooked up, man. It's good. <laughs> that That's fast. a great fish, man. That was fast. That was fast. Bien. Trace Libras? See? Mmm. I gotta sniff that first one, baby. <laughs> There we go. Chunky. That a kid. One last jump. Extra like button. All <laughs> right. Yeah, that's money. There Got he him. is. There we go, Logue. Hooked up, baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's grande, how are you? There, hey, guess what? He was there. It's a PB for me. <laughs> if this fish is doing that to you on that rod, <laughs> I can't wait to see what they're doing. With one. Yes, sir. <laughs> Oh, yeah. First actual bass for myself. Congratulations. <laughs> yeah. That's good. That's for, uh... Oh. Got her again. There you go, bud. Oh, oh man, come on. It. I got to set harder. This is right where I saw the foils. There You're booked is. up. Yes, sir. <laughs> There's your next PB, baby. <laughs> Rackley got me uh, dialed. Safe to say, you guys. Oh, right in that spot. Yep, you're Same exactly spot, right. Dude. Justin, this is really fun. <laughs> I have a smile on my face. <laughs> this is so fun, dude. Got it? Oh my gosh. Guys, fish number three. We're out here today with, I haven't properly introduced you yet to the video today. Well, This is Justin Rackley. You might know him as Lakeport guy. Give her a dangle. Give her a dangle. Bye. Heck yeah. Um, we're out here with a bunch of buddies. Justin definitely knows what he's doing. This is, this is my first time ever bass fishing. And uh, number three. You're gonna have somebody in your boat for your first time. Might as well be this guy. No, oh, thank you. <laughs> Give me too much credit, man. You got you got three fish. You were, I, you were on the leaderboard. Right I'd have still been plopping that top water thing if you weren't here. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, we got rid of that. So now it's time for business. <laughs> got rid of that quick. That's why they have to have see. on him. Yeah, little that guy. A baby. Dude, it just stopped me. It got me on the the move. Hell yeah. God, that's. Mexico is one of the few places where a little fish like that will make you think, like, <laughs> I've got a donkey. <laughs> it's so funny, dude. Nice. Boat flips, huh? Yeah, heavy. Right when I turned you guys off, fish number six, still, uh, still rocking that wacky rig. There she is. I'll leave you guys on, I promise. There he is. There he is. Good there, bud. Oh, that's a decent one. That's, that's what I like dreadful. That's going away from the bank, just like you said, man. Yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> I'll take that one. Dog puppy. Yeah, buddy. Right through that top lip. Perfect hook. Like so. You guys, that's a little bit bigger. That's that's like a three pound mouth, four pound body. Look at that chunk. Looks like a little female. Look at that. Look at that, ladies and gents. Woo Look at that bucket mouth. How cool. PB, How cool. buddy. That's a PB for me, <laughs> for sure. Dang, it feels like a 10 pounder in my hand. <laughs> That's awesome. Let's get a couple picks. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. That was a bite. That, Rackley, that was a bite. Felt that the thump? A little bit different than those first ones. Look at that thing. Handled it beautifully, man. Played him just perfect. <sighs> Look at that thing, nice dude. Fish. <laughs> Guys, my first, oh! 
Nice. That might be my perfect. How big you think? Six? Four pounds. Maybe five. Maybe, Maybe five. five. <laughs> it's a fish. Hey. We caught one. Dude. We got two now. Nice work, Casey. Heck yeah. We take a pick for me? Well, that's probably five pounds. Is what it does look like five now. Yeah. Maybe four and a half. Get on him. Heck yeah, I'll take it. Whew. And check out what I caught it on. Big old storm swim bait. I like it. You want one, y'all? Possibly. That's kind of fun to catch Possibly. One on there. Yeah. No, no grande? Pequeño. Pequeño. Chill. It's a fish. At this point, we'll take anything. We'll take it. Nice. Oh, yeah. Want a picture? No. Okay. We'll on the old Senko. Let him go, let him grow, you know? He ate it. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> oh. Had a bite? Yeah. There you go. Oh! That was a nicer fish. That was a good one. Dang it. Oh. Dude, close to the boat. Okay. Huh? There you go. There you go. Whoa, buddy. Hey, that's almost your your current PB. Yeah. It's like two pounds, you say, right? That's right. Yeah, you want to wait that one? That, that one is probably two pounds for yeah. sure. We're getting there. Yeah. We'll I think you got your new PB. <laughs> Just take your time, take your time. Yeah, that's definitely a four. At least a four. There we go. <laughs> take your time. I got her. Okay. Oh! <laughs> On the board. Hey, biggest fun of the day so biggest far. Biggest fun of the day. Yeah. The new guy figures it out. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. That's a scale worthy. Your new PB for Mexico is 330. 3.3, .3, not quite 3.3, yeah. But we're getting there. Yeah. New PB weighed and caught, and you have witness too. That's right. Because I job. saw it. Juan's hooking me up today. First, that's the best fish of the day so far. We're working yep. our way up to the big guys though this afternoon. Yeah. Oh yeah, for sure. Hundred percent. Adios, senorita. Nice. Well, just got on the board. First official fish that we've weighed. Three point three. Nothing giant, but hey, it's definitely it's my first good fish. Yeah. Here on the lake and. Yeah. My personal best fish. Juan's been setting me up, teaching me all the ways. He's doing great. Good Honest job, buddy. opinion. No, you're doing. You're doing amazing, dude. Good, good. You got a bigger fish than me. <laughs> He's got he's got the numbers though. Yeah. I got I just got the weight, but yeah. we finally just hit this little pocket. We've caught just a, like three three of them in the last yeah. I don't know four casts basically. Yeah, yeah. What are you throwing on yours? So I'm throwing a, a longer log, like a Guggen longer log. It's si similar to a Senko, okay. but it's uh, very well sized. Uh, Big one. It's, yeah, it's like eight inches. Uh, just Texas rig peg. You don't have yours peg, so your weight is pretty free. You know, yeah. so that kind of gives your bait a little bit different fall ratio. You know than mine. Uh, and then you uh, throw in a lizard too, which has a little bit more action than my bait. Uh, but the whole thing, I think this is the first uh, point that we're hitting off the main lake. So all the other stuff that we're fishing is being like tucked in into the pockets of the main lake. Yeah. But this is the first uh, area of the main lake that we're fishing because you, you know, that's the main lake right there. You know, we're just looking for small little pockets and this one produced four fish already. Not bad. Three or four. Yeah. Here's my little setup right there that I just caught that fish on. Lizard guy. Just kind of tucked back in this little corner here. Just kind of working our way through all this stuff. Just Crazy. caught that one right in here. We'll just keep moving. We've been sticking and moving quite a bit. Anyways, uh, only thing I'm nervous about today is running out of GoPro batteries for like catching the hook set. It's just uh, I'm trying to film a lot of these because I think the hook set's the funnest part of yeah. this kind of stuff. But we'll keep doing our best. Hopefully the other guys are having fun catching some fish. We uh, we're kind of out on our own, so we won't see them until lunchtime. You want to catch bite? I got one. Oh my god! Good one. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> That might be my PB. Right? That might be my PB. Hey, listen, I've been so close so many times Dude. that I just don't wanna I don't wanna jinx it. 
Ooh. I don't want to jinx it. It looks big, but I caught big fish before and they're only like eight pounds, you know? Only. But yeah, only. <laughs> Guys, I literally just hit stop oh, and nice. he's just like, I got a fish. Whack. And dude, that thing <laughs> breached out of the water. <laughs> That's why you come to this lake right here, fish hey, like this. Any cast, any cast can be that cast, dude. Look at this thing. Oh my <laughs> God. <laughs> mira, mira, look at this, look at this. Look at this, look at this. Oh, oh, oh. oh like nothing. Oh my god. <laughs> look at this. She's 20. Yeah, 23 and a half. That's an ancient fish right here. Really old. You can tell, you know, from the scars right here. You can tell that she's getting ready to spawn too, you know. Look at that. That's a good sign of spawning as well. Oh yeah, six. Yeah, point I, four I was, eight. I was thinking seven. Ah. Yeah, six and a half. That's awesome. Morning session is over. We're headed to lunch. Anxious to hear how the rest of the crew is done. I'd say we've had a pretty good morning though so far. I'm, uh, I'm feeling optimistic about the afternoon. After we go refuel, take a little nap. Maybe a little break, a little lunch. It is warm, fellers. I bet it's, what, 90? It heated up fast. We didn't do so hot on the bass fishing, me and Chell. We're very uh, amateur at best. <laughs> I did catch a nice five pounder though, um, but we've only caught three fish total on our boat. But I've been going like big plastics. Here's my thing, I can go Sanko, but it's really tough to tell a bite on a Sanko. So I'm throwing stuff that I know when a fish eats it, it's a fish. I might switch that up this afternoon. I'm going after numbers now. Okay. Well, welcome back this afternoon. We uh, went back, had a little lunch. Took maybe potentially like a small cat nap. Had a few teams start to change up. Uh, I'm not I think, liking their partners. So. I think Juan and I walked away with the most fish caught. Yeah. So that's that's exciting. Now we got to go get the bit biggest. There was one that was seven pounds, eleven ounces, which is a big fish. Yeah. Hot. It's got to be over ninety degrees out. So uh, we're gonna go back and finish up what we started. Big, grande. Good size. Doubled, doubled up again. Doubled up. You got some juice. Watch that trolling motor. Like I said, dude, like could be a little bigger, bud. Could be bigger. Woo hoo hoo! There you go. So we got your load. He ain't bad. He ain't bad. He ain't bad. He ain't Fiber, bad. Fiber, baby. Woo hoo! Yeah. That's my guy. That's doubled up. <laughs> on the GoPro too, doubled up. 488. 486. I'll take it. It's a PB. Congrats, bro. That's Give it a little PB. water and we'll get a pick. Yeah. 48. PB. Let's take it. Got him? Yeah. Powerful. <laughs> Another just chunk, two and three quarter fish. Nice fish, dude. Nice. Fun to catch. There you go. Little guy. Super little guy. Oh. <laughs> no, another fish for the camera there. Ooh, it's the hook. Got him. Uh, I'm getting running. that whole I'm getting that whole bite thing. There you go. I can't tell when you set the hook on that thing, man. It looks like it's I know. Eight on there. Uh, Five for the night. There. there. Oh, yeah, you are. Nope. That's how we're doing it right now. Nope, you got it covered. You got him. He My man. Be a biggin. No. <laughs> Three, here's one. On? Come on. <laughs> Uncut. Got him. There you go. Oh, you got, I got another one. I got one, Log. On. Ah! <laughs> this is for you folks at home, is what it's for. 
Mm. Belly bumps. Belly bumps. That's another one. That's like a four pounder, isn't it? Yeah, that's nice. Meteor. What did we say we were gonna do on our double? Uh, I think it's a uh, shotgun of beer. Shotgun of beer, that's what <laughs> that's, it was. That's what it was. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. Let's let these guys go. Meteor one, rack, two. Just double. Can we do a flips. synchronized like dive team? Bonus like points Yo! right there. All right, you guys. Um, we had that hot streak for a little bit back there. Then we changed locations. Um, LFG here. Just released one. It's been a little bit slower. We're probably at like 23, 23 fish now, 24. So numbers are good, just nothing super heavy yet. We're looking for that mas grande. And when we get it, we'll get some really good footage of it. But we're just working these banks. Moving, trying, moving, trying. I got here. Here's a here's an update. Yeah, the biggest thing going on is your toe. <laughs> um, so a bee crawled in one of the holes of my crocodiles and uh, got me right between the pinky toe. I was going to take my croc off to figure out what the heck was crawling around, and I got stung. So there's that. It's the top five worst places to get stung by a bee, I'd say. But other than that, it's been a great day. I love Mexico. So we're just gonna keep going and uh, hopefully we'll find that big, bigger class fish. Stay tuned. Hey, are we doing it? Yep. Guys, we have switched up teams. Changing of the guard. Changing of the guard. So this morning it was me and Chell. Uh, Trent was with Noah. Yep, excuse me. Uh, we, ch we changed it up. So me and Trent are, uh, what's our team name? Let's just team win the tournament. Team we got win a side, the tournament. Team side bet. So we have a tournament going on and then we have a side bet tonight. And then we have a daily tournament as well. Yeah, we have a bunch of stuff. Yeah. Tonight though is our side bets twenty dollars a team. Yep. Three biggest fish. Four teams are entered in already. So we just need three big ones. Three big. That's all we're asking for. Super and if you guys saw this morning, we, me and Chell only caught three fish, and they weren't that big. Hey, we're gonna get more. Let's go to work. Let's go. Where did we catch the four pound It was not very deep. Just so you know. Bottom. bottom. Yeah. Got it? Yeah. Fish on. Will you yeah. grab that camera? Yep. Oh, big one. Big one. Big one. Big one. Uh, What's that? How do I turn it? Oh. Push the top button on. Got it. On. Okay. Yes. That's a big one, bud. That's a big one. So we need you, our you got this. You got this. Grande. That's giant. Oh my god. That's giant. Just show me that hog. That thing is giant. Is that your biggest one ever? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How big is that, Alonzo? Maybe seven. What? Seven? <laughs> No huevos, no gordo. Yeah, no, the no fat. No, no huevos. No eggs. That's got to be Hello. eight. The macho. Oh, you got to zero it out. Take it off. Oh, eight four. Eight four. Oh. We calling it? Eight four. PB. <laughs> yeah, PB. That thing is giant. PB, get that good scale. Get the good video of it. Eight four two. <laughs> that thing is mondo. Yeah, we're gonna do a video. Be careful, don't don't put him over the water. All right, boys. <laughs> Here it is. Oh my Eight goodness. Four, oh. Woo! That is big. You give me a couple pictures. Yeah, it's so big. Okay, film me releasing him. Okay. <gasps> That's a big one. Can you imagine a 12? Dude, I can't. You can't. I can't. That thing's giant. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Only takes one trend. There's two more of those. Hey, we'll win. Told you we would make it, buddy. PB. Good job, brother. Heck yes. Let's get after more. All right. Big daddy. Big daddy. Big daddy. Big daddy Trent's on the board. <laughs> He's on the board. Yes. Woo. Six pounds, I bet. Ah, it's at least five. Now we just need one more. One more. One more. We need one more. Guys, we are doing a tournament as big as three bass. So there's four teams in. Uh, We've only got one fish in the bag. Now monster, we got two. It's a good one. It's a good one. It's a good All one. we need is three, three fish. Three fish. How do we do this, bud? We'll take it though. That's four, a, three, eight. Four, three, eight. You, four, got, three, you eight. like it? Holding yep. it by the top. 
438. 438. Okay. So that's okay. 12, eight. 8. Almost, yeah, 12, 8. 12, 8, 1. Let's let her go. Not bad for two fish. Not bad. Jumper. There yeah. we go. <laughs> that's what we like. Sweet. All right, one more fish. One more fish, man. Let's do it. We're going to win this thing. Small. We need Canyon. a bag, though. Canyon. Just weigh them so we have a bag. It's a bag of fish. It's not very big, but you know what? It could we be can enough. always upgrade. Always we can upgrade. always upgrade. So you so, have to have three fish. So we've only weighed two. Not very big. Not <laughs> pounder. Give me a clamping. Got her? Yeah. Oh, 175? No, 172. 172. Okay, so we got okay. a bag. 438, 172, and 842. 842. You guys at home can do the math. We're going I, downhill. Because I can't. <laughs> but that's our bag thus far. Let's upgrade. He, he's so good. Give me a kiss. Quick little afternoon update. Taking a little break here in the shade. Got pretty warm out on the, the open water behind us there. So we uh, are hitting these kind of like little cut banks, cliff edges. Been a pretty good afternoon. I think we've each picked up a handful of fish. I got my personal best, which wasn't like, let's be honest, wasn't much to have to beat. Um, I'd only caught like maybe one or two bass in my life before this trip. So certainly uh, put on a lot of numbers today, but I got a 5.2 pound three. fish, 5.2 or three, somewhere right in there. Anyways, we're making progress, but you know, you kind of got to earn your stripes. You can't just show up at one of these lakes and start catching eight pounders. Eight, four. Eight, four, oh. we calling it? Eight, four. <laughs> So Juan's taught me a lot. He's been a great teacher, super patient, just kind of like helping me understand some of the different techniques, intricacies of how you could be more proficient catching these bass out here. And so far it's working. I'm picking it up good. I'm feeling good. I think by the end of this trip, I'll, I'll be a much more uh, seasoned bass angler than, than when I started. I tell you, it's, it's a lot of work. I mean, we were up at 5, 10 this morning and outside from a quick lunch, pretty much on the water all day. And that's kind of the routine. There's not a lot of amenities at the lodge outside of just fishing. So far day one's been fantastic. I hope uh, we can rope into like a seven pound plus fish. That's what I'm shooting for for our boat. My time to start fishing begins again right now. Juan's <laughs> on fire. I'm in it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. See? Nah. Hey. Yeah. Oh, oh my god! Yeah, dude. Oh my god! Yeah! Senori. Just another tank. Look back to thing. back fish. Look at that thing. That's... Dude, we find the juice, bro. Right? This is the juice right here. It's been a good run right there. We're gonna get back in the water. <laughs> Oh, that was fun. Good day. Uh, not a numbers guy. I've caught two fish all day long. You caught only one tonight? One. One in the morning, one in the evening. How big? Good one. Good. For sure. What about you guys? That was a fun first day. Kind of into this bass fishing stuff. Set a couple PBs, you know? <laughs> Super fun, man. It was awesome going out with somebody like Juan who has just tons of experience. He's really knowledgeable and he was very helpful. But I feel way better right now than I did when I jumped on the boat this morning as far as just like knowing what to expect, techniques and all that stuff. But fun day, I will say I'm I'm pretty tired. We, we fished a lot. <laughs> like literally two, th three, we had three more days of this. We we're gonna be wiped out. But uh, I think if we keep working hard and grinding, like we're gonna break that double digit wreck like number. You know, everybody's kind of 10 pounds is the pinnacle that you're trying to chase here. I feel good it's gonna happen, but I'm also excited for dinner. Are you slow playing? Yeah, he is. No. What I caught two fish all day. What was your second fish one, like? One, what? What was your second fish like? It was a good one. How, how good? A good one. I, I think it's a fish you come out here to catch. Oh. What? Hey, oh. Is it, yeah. is it start nope. and end with? Nope. It's not double. What is it? It's good. Yeah. My favorite number. It's my high school baseball number. Close. Do you know what my high school baseball number was? Nine. Oh, yeah, dude. What is that? Is that nine? I'm trying to. No, not quite. It didn't have a gut on it. If it would have had a gut, it would have been. That's all the ones we're catching are pretty skinny too. Ooh, eight four two in the lead, my I think, dude. 
Yeah! What was your bag, Noah? You got it. We win one fish tonight. Do we win all of them, Trent? Do we win it up? Okay, I'll tell you now. Oh, Patrick's out there. So we had we've had we have two competitions going. Big fish of the day, and then this afternoon, a couple of teams threw down 20 bucks. A team for best three fish bag. So your three biggest fish. We start off really hot. I caught an 8.42. That was the first one we weighed, and then Trent caught a four and a half, and then we caught like a 1.75, so we're like a 14 pound bag, which isn't bad, which isn't bad. But if we would have matched all three with the first fish, 24 pounds, 25 pounds, that'd be a good bag. 